comments on Ding playing through this rivet uh, it doesn't surprise me. Uh, I didn't really know much about it until uh, until it became public. Um, you know, he's generally when he has something going on, he kind of keeps it to himself. So um, I would say it's um, not surprising. Certainly, the training staff evaluated him. So. Yeah, and you know, like I said, I wasn't much aware of it. I didn't know, you know, how much it was bothering him until. Until yesterday. I imagine just him getting that else makes it even more impressive. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's um, it's that time of year. I mean, everybody's not everybody, but a lot of people have things that they're going through. Ennis had his shoulder, Rodney had his knee, Mo had, you know, everybody has some things they're fighting through. Team going into this next game. Um, well, pretty much what you would think. No. <laughs> and now you guys can interview Joe. Because no way, man. What I think. No way, man. Did anything stand out to you when you kind of went back and watched the film? Well, as disappointing as the third quarter was last night, it wasn't the same as the third quarter in game two. Uh, third quarter in game two, we had a lot of turnovers. It was a blitzkrieg. You know, it's just uh, we had our opportunities in the third quarter to have a good offensive quarter and we didn't take advantage of them and so it was actually a little more encouraging than after game two what's it been like having coach you back around uh he's been in the it's good to see him more than anything else he's um you know he's been in the last couple coaches meetings um his sister lets him out for an hour or so so uh there's a rumor he might even be at the game tomorrow so that'd be great